opportunity to have a talk here. Uh, my title is uh, uh, "Closed String Symmetries in Open String." Ah, uh, closed string symmetry on OpenSFT. Uh, subtitle is "Tachyon Vacuum as Science Square Deformations." Uh, uh, this is uh, based on the work uh, in. Uh, worked on the, uh, this, uh, this paper in collaboration with Kishimoto Kitade, and uh, furthermore, uh, the, uh, the work in progress with uh, Kishimoto Kitade, Seki-kun, and Tsuta-san. It is well known that uh, open string field theory uh, had a ta uh, tachyon vacuum, and there, uh, the open string uh, disappears. But there, uh, there is a, we believe that the uh, closed string living in a bulk space time are found in, uh, at the tachyon vacuum. On the other hand, uh, in string theory, uh, it has been long considered that closed string, uh, closed string dynamics is described by open string degree of freedom. I mean, uh, uh, the example is uh, uh, such a theory is given by the BFS S theory, matrix theory or IKKT matrix theory. In such a theory, uh, the matrix is derived from the uh, 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 masterless mode of, uh, uh, of, uh, of, of strings. And uh, it, uh, for, uh, another example is uh, ADS CFT is uh, a version of sophisticated, uh, sophisticated version uh, to realize uh, these expectations. And uh, most old, uh, at, uh, most old naive intuitions, uh, a closed string is given by a bound state of an open string. So open string is regarded as a fundamental degree of freedom. <coughs> Uh, about 10 years ago, uh, Gendier, Karl Kumar, Nishino uh, uh, made a, uh, a discover, uh, made an important discovery concerning discretized open closed system in condensed matter physics. They considered uh, any side system uh, given by this Hamiltonian. This Hamiltonian here is the <coughs> uh, C, uh, here the CL is a fermionic, anti, uh, fermionic oscillators uh, satisfied uh, usual uh, anti-commutation relations. And uh, furthermore, this Hamiltonian includes this factor. This, this factor is uh, uh, from, uh, in this system, uh, we consider n site from one to n minus, uh, from one to n. Uh, this factor is uh, dumped uh, at the boundaries. Uh, so uh, this is a deformed Hamiltonian, uh, an usual uh, conventional uniform open system by the science square first. In this sense, they found that uh, uh, this system is equivalent uh, with periodic boundary conditions by calculating the ground, uh, ground state energy and or uh, correlation functions numerically. These results uh, uh, suggest that the discretized closed system can be described by degree of uh, freedom of discretized op uh, <laughs> described by degree of freedom of a discretized open system. And if we consider the continuum limit in this Hamiltonian, uh, the uh, this uh, equivalent is uh, continued to. Uh, two dimensional in uh, realizing the two dimensional field theory. Uh, after the seminar paper, uh, this deformation is called the science square deformation or SSD, and uh, it has been uh, studied actively. Uh, let me explain uh, the d some detail of SSD. Uh, <coughs> because uh, SSD is a uh, 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 I think uh, it's unfamiliar for uh, our community. This, uh, this equivalence uh, between the open and closed systems uh, 
is uh, understood as a result of the ex uh, equivalence of the ground state of the SSD and the uniform periodic system. Uh, I mean, uh, uh, closed uh, periodic system, in the periodic system, the Hamiltonian is given by the, here. Uh, uh, this is a uniform, mean there, there is no sign square factor, and the periodic uh, is, given, uh, is realized by these boundary conditions. And the uh, uh, sign square deformation Hamiltonian is given by uh, in, the pre uh, in the previous slide. So, uh, for this system, well, we can calculate the ground state. I mean, uh, 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 just the number of states in this system is uh, 2 to the n. I mean, uh, uh, every state is, uh, is given by uh, uh, some folk vacuum, and uh, uh, a folk vacuum acting uh, co creation operated, Fermi creation operated, and uh, some uh, linear combination of these states is given by like this. So, uh, in the finite, uh, the state space is finite dimensional, we can calculate numerically or this Hamiltonian diagonal, uh, we can diagonalize this Hamiltonian and uh, we can calculate the ground state uh, for cross, in the closed system uh, and uh, for SSD system. And they observe, uh, Hikihara and Nishino observed numerically, uh, this, this vacuum, uh, uh, is are, are equivalent numerically. They, they observe the equivalence numerically, and as, as it means they are in a product of this state equal one uh, and some normalization. And so, I rated uh, Katsura uh, in Tokyo University it proved uh, exactly the equivalence is realized. <coughs> uh, huh? uh, Peri periodic system. Alpha and alpha, alpha and alpha. No, 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 no. <laughs> uh, And uh, uh, later we discuss how to realize in the continuum system of uh, this equivalence, how to realize. But uh, uh, in this, discre uh, this discretized system, uh, this is uh, sufficient for the uh, sufficient to realize uh, closed system. <laughs> Essentially, yes, yes. Uh, anyway, uh, 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 let me explain further in the next slide. <coughs> yes, yes, this is a period guy, yes. Uh, this system is a usual easing system. <coughs> yes. The, this system, it's right, <coughs> up, down, one, two, n minus one, no, no, n, n plus one. But it didn't start here, n minus Yes, yes, exact, exactly. Okay. Huh? Or capital A. Capital N, yeah, N. Finite, finite. 
finite end, uh, uh, they, uh, they, uh, Katsura proved for finite end, they even uh, realized. So, uh, Later, uh, the SSD has been extended to, deform, uh, extended to deformation with other suppression factors, and uh, the generalized SSD has been applied not only to the free filament system, but also to various models. Uh, they are studied uh, these people. <laughs> Moreover, uh, SSD has been also studied in the context of field theoretical descriptions, uh, Katsura, Tada, uh, Ishibashi, Ishibashi san, and uh, Okunishi, and uh, the way you read it. I think uh, uh, these uh, studies about SSD uh, strong, strongly suggested uh, the equivalence of SSD system. Uh, no, uh, this study, uh, uh, anyway. <laughs> Uh, this study strongly suggests the equivalence of SSD system uh, in the string, uh, I think, uh, in the string theoretical viewpoint. Uh, this suggests the possibility of closed string theories in terms of open strings. On the other hand, uh, interestingly, uh, it has been point, uh, pointed out uh, Ishibashi Tada. Uh, there is an uh, intimate relation between the SSD system and the open string SF, uh, open SFT. Uh, in open SFT, uh, it is known that the identity-based tachyon solutions uh, provide uh, kinematic operated corresponding to Hamiltonian at the tachyon vacuum. This is, uh, 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 this is given by these equations. Here, T prime Z is a twisted ghost energy momentum tensor, and uh, it involves this factor. Uh, this factor, if we change in this factor as Z equal exponential i theta, uh, the waiting function, this waiting function is, uh, uh, becomes sine square theta, theta uh, due to uh, the Jacobian and the factor. So, uh, the Hamiltonian uh, at the tachyon vacuum uh, is related to the SSD, uh, Ham uh, Hamiltonian in CFT. <coughs> uh, I think uh, this part, SSD and SFT, uh, indicates that we can formulate a pure closed string theory without boundaries in terms of uh, open string field, sorry, uh, open string field and the identity-based tachyon vacuum solution. In this talk, uh, motivated by this possibility, uh, we try to find closed string symmetries in open SFT at the identity-based tachyon vacuum. Here, uh, we will strongly use a technique uh, that developed in dipolar quantization of two-dimensional conformal theory by Ishibashi Tadasan. This is from my talk. Next, uh, we propose uh, uh, make a SSD mechanism. Uh, I, I, I mean, uh, how to how to realize uh, such a equi equivalence uh, between the op open uh, open and closed system. And next, and then uh, we discuss closed string symmetry at the tachyon vacuum. First, uh, we start uh, with the Hamiltonian, open string Hamiltonian. Open string Hamiltonian is given by uh, this equation here: Tz is the energy moment of tensor, and C plus as C minus is the uh, integration pass uh, along. Uh, uh, this figure uh, around uh, se semi half semi half circle on the upper half plane, and the C minus is lying on, is lying on the lower half plane. Uh, each term uh, corresponds to the Hamiltonian and left moving and right move right moving modes. Uh, the, but but in the open strings, 
they do not commute with each other due to open string boundary conditions. Uh, the Hamiltonian is given by uh, L0 of the Villas law operated. Uh, here, uh, uh, <coughs> uh, we am, I emphasize that uh, we do not encounter L0 children and the Hormic counterpart in the open, open string system. Here, uh, next uh, we consider the deformed Hamiltonian, uh, some weighting function GZ. Here we impose GZ as a homework function satisfying uh, a G, uh, Z equal plus minus one corresponding to the boundary. Uh, this means that uh, GZ is uh, uh, enough, uh, enough, enough dump uh, on the boundary. Here, it is, uh, as, in open string, as in the open string system, this HG plus uh, left moving mode of HG, HG minus is right moving mode of HG. Uh, this, uh, as, G, as this GZ, uh, the simplest example of GZ is given by this function. Uh, this means that uh, GZ uh, has second order zeros on the boundaries. Uh, this is a simplest example. If we, if we change the variables as z equal exponential i theta, the weighting function is, is, is in hg is changed to sine square theta. Hence, uh, this deformed Hamiltonian appro uh, uh, provides a uh, generalization of SSD, SSD Hamiltonian. What? Imaginary part? Imaginary part. Yeah. You mean? Uh, no, 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 no. No, no. This is exact. Uh, combining the conformal uh, fracted and the uh, Jacobian, is that converted to sine square theta? Combining Jacobian from, uh, given by the, uh, giving from DZ and the conformal factor uh, uh, is given by given from DZ. So DZ converted to sine square theta. Okay. Uh, anyway, in this sense, we call it uh, uh, the, uh, as a generalization of science square deformations, so uh, we call it uh, the science square like deformation or for SSLD for short. <coughs> Here, uh, TZ is expanded by homomorphic virus operators only. By using these exp expansions uh, and the virus algebra uh, between the L and N, we, we obtain the commutation relation of TZ. Here, delta, uh, delta z, z prime is, uh, uh, denotes a delta function uh, and, and uh, C is a central charge. Uh, by this, this commutation relations, uh, we can calculate the commutation relation between Hg plus and Hg minus. The point is, uh, is that uh, in, in the calculations, uh, we, we see the surface term as a result of the derivative of the delta functions. And uh, these terms include, uh, in, the uh, in the surface term, is uh, the single factor uh, delta plus delta one one or delta minus one minus one includes, included. <coughs> So, but uh, the singular surface terms uh, turn out to vanish due to the fact that g plus minus one and or del g plus minus one. Uh, in the definition, we uh, they are set to set to be zero. Of, uh, that, uh, as a result, we find that uh, 
the satisfying uh, the for the functions satisfying this relation this conditions uh hg plus hg minus are commutable uh, so the deformed system is decomposed into the left and the right left and right moving parts in the periodic system as in periodic system so uh, we conclude that uh, deformed system SSLD deformed system described by HG corresponds uh, not to an open string system, but a closed string system. Also, the Hamiltonian is constructed by a single form of equal energy moment of tensor TZ. Okay. Uh, he, now uh, we will illustrate equal time contours generated by the Hamiltonian for the simplest case, uh, with a focus on uh, how to derive the, uh, this de such a decoupling of left and right moving sectors. Uh, according to Ishibashi san tada san, uh, we introduced the time parameter t and their uh, s par uh, the parameter s, which parameterizes a string at a certain time uh, into the world sheet generated by Hamiltonian HG. This is, uh, he, they, they, uh, they, they introduce such a parameter is, uh, uh, such parameter, uh, such parameter is introduced as this relation. <clears throat> uh, if we introduce polar coordinate as, as Z equal R exponential I theta, uh, they can be expressed by the parameter T and S on the upper frame, upper, upper half frame, uh, like this equation, on the lower half frame, uh, given by these equations. And so we illustrate uh, by these equations uh, as a resulting contour uh, is given by like this. Uh, here, uh, uh, solid lines, uh, uh, denotes the uh, equal time contoured, and thus lines with arrows denote evolution of time. So, uh, uh, at initial time, the strings uh, is on the here, and the time uh, after time evolved, as time evolving, the strings uh, expand uh, like this figure. And so, uh, Going to the past, the string the shrink to uh, like this figure. <coughs> uh, this is a, a lower half frame is uh, also forward. <coughs> and these contours have a remarkable future. A string boundary uh, z equal plus minus one are fixed during propagations, uh, and uh, Another, uh, another point is uh, uh, comp one complex number, T plus Is, corresponds at two points in the Z frame. Uh, one is uh, on the upper half frame and one is on the lower half frame. So uh, we introduced a complex coordinate W equal to T plus Is for the upper, fr upper half Z frame and W bar for the lower half, uh, lower half frame. Uh, so, I mean, uh, uh, this is the uh, equal time co contours on the dead point and uh, split to uh, uh, upper and lower. And this massing, mapping, the upper half frame corresponds to the, this double, the four double points and the lower half uh, frame to the uh, map to the double bar frame. <coughs> So uh, the equal con contours by HG lead us to the world seed, which consists of two complex planes. The two planes W and W bar, uh, W and W, W and W bar correspond to the upper and lower half Z planes. Uh, the two planes are generated by the left and right moving Hamiltonian HG plus and HG minus respectively. So, uh, HG plus 
no, no, no. A W bar and W W and W bar friend can be regarded as holomorphic and anti-holomorphic world set of a closed string. Uh, now is that we have obtained two decoupled Hamiltonians for the right, left and right moving sectors. Uh, we can construct uh, two independent Villas row operators according to Isibashi Tada. Uh, here, GZ is the same function, same weighting function included in the Hamiltonian. And uh, here, F kappa Z is defined by these differential equations according to Isibashi Tada. Uh, here, the C plus T and C minus T denote integral controllers are of the equal timeline uh, uh, on the upper half and the lower half plane. Here, uh, we should note again, this TZ uh, is the same TZ. I mean, uh, uh, the TZ in the El Kappa children is not the anti counterpart. So uh, this is including L kappa L kappa children is the same energy momentum, tem, momentum tensor of the open open string system. Uh, in this definition, L zero and L zero children provide the left and right moving parts of the Hamiltonian, uh, namely L zero equals H G plus and L zero children equals H G minus. And moreover, El Kappa satisfies this continuous Virasol algebra discovered by Ishibashi Tada. The right moving sector of the Virasol operator El Kappa children uh, can be also defined by integration along the uh, integration path on the lower half plane. And uh, El Kappa children satisfies the same uh, continuous Virasol algebra. It is easily, it can be easily seen there. Moreover, uh, since C plus T and C minus T have no intersections, L kappa and L kappa children commute with each other. So, uh, uh, we found the two independent Virasol algebra in a deformed open string system which can be regarded as a Virasol algebra for closed strings. So uh, that, uh, that, uh, that is a holomorphic, anti-holomorphic part of the Virasol algebra. Uh, the continuous Virasol algebra is explicitly calculated for the simplest weighting functions, GZ, correspond to sine square, sine square theta. Uh, we, calculate, we can calculate this, this part for uh, sine, square, sine square theta. As a result, we can uh, this uh, very complicated result. Uh, here, but uh, the sound, this, this complicated term is characteristic in this weighting function, sine square theta. But it can be absorbed in a shift of El Kappa. Uh, I mean, uh, here is a uh, proportional to Kappa minus Kappa plus, and uh, this function, uh, uh, this is a function of Kappa plus Kappa prime. So uh, El Kappa, uh, this, this complicated term absor can be absorbed in the, uh, the definition of El Kappa. In fact, uh, in the double play, double play, uh, for uh, two, two complex, two complex plane, W and W bar, we define a Virasol algebra associated with the copper. Here, C plus hat T is an image of C plus T by the conhomer transformation. Consequently, for uh, this L kappa hat, uh, we can find a simpler form of a continuous Virasol algebra. Uh, this is uh, independent of uh, uh, the base, uh, the weighting function of weighting function GZ. Thus, uh, we, we propose that this expression of the continuous Virasol algebra uh, it, it, 
this expression continuous bias algebra is universal for science scale deformed system is relevant to GZ. Uh, it is uh, this this point is also uh, uh, is also emphasized by Ishibashi Tada in the in the original paper. So. Uh, so far, uh, we discussed the, how to realize uh, decoupling, uh, decoupling of left and right moving modes in the SSD system. Here, uh, next, uh, we discussed uh, in the string field theory. Uh, we consider the cubic open bosonic string field theory. Uh, in this theory, uh, the equation of motion is given by qb psi plus psi, uh, QB psi, QB psi plus psi square equals zero. Uh, a tachyon vacuum solution is given by uh, the base uh, uh, is given by uh, using the identity state. Uh, this is uh, uh, given by this form. <coughs> uh, here, uh, I is the identity state and H. Uh, some functions satisfying this uh, in, is imposed these relations under QLF uh, defined by VRS current times function F and integrating, uh, integrating along the left uh, along the left half left part of the string and the CLG is also defined for ghost field CZ. So, uh, moreover, uh, the point is that if this solution correspond to tachyon vacuum, expo exponential HZ must have second or higher order zeros on C left. If we expand the string field around the solution, this solution psi zero, we obtain an action on the fractionation psi. The action is given by this equation, where the modified VRST operator Q prime is given by uh, this operator. Here, the operator QF uh, and the CF uh, define the integration on the four unit circle. I mean, uh, QLF is defined on the integ uh, integrating along the C, C left path, but uh, here, Q, uh, QF is defined on the, uh, defined by integrating for a full circle. Uh, for these solutions, uh, the vanishing cohomologies uh, have been or, or, uh, already proved, and the, the cohomology uh, provides evidence that the solutions correctly represent the tachyon vacuum solutions, and their uh, vacuum structure evaluate numerically up to 26, uh, 26 level, and then uh, exactly uh, it, the vacuum structure evaluated by Ishibashi and uh, Kishimasu Masada Takahashi. <coughs> so uh, let me consider uh, uh, some details of uh, this uh, the Q prime. First, we decompose the modified VRC operator Q prime into two parts uh, corresponding to the integration around the upper and the lower semicircles. The Q, I mean the Q prime equal to Q plus prime and the Q minus prime. Uh, assuming uh, that the FZ and GZ have zeros at Z equal to plus minus one, uh, we can easily find that uh, these anti-commutation relations. And so by using these anti-commutation relations, we find that there, uh, ah, one, one, one assumption we need. We consider the identity-based tachyon vacuum solution generated by exponential HZ with second order zeros only at Z equal plus minus one. This is a special case of our solutions. Uh, in this case, uh, owing to using these anti-commutation relations, uh, the operator Q prime modified BS operator Q prime splits into two anti-commutative or uncommutative anti-commutative nilpotent operators. I mean the Q plus 
prime square equals zero, q minus prime square equals zero, and the uh, anti commutation uh, q plus minus q minus q minus prime are anti commutative. Here, uh, this decomposition of the modified BRC operators uh, occurs only for the tachyon vacuum solution. I mean, uh, uh, this is a strong, uh, uh, strong uh, here the, the point is the exponential HZ have second order zeros at Z equal plus minus one. So here, so, uh, and uh, we noticed that the decomposition is similar to uh, the decomposition of the SSL, SSLD Hamiltonian. By analogy, uh, in the previous uh, case for SSL, SSLD Hamiltonian, we think uh, uh, Q plus minus and the Q, Q plus prime, Q prime prime, Q prime Q plus prime, Q minus prime can be regarded as holomorphic and anti-holomorphic BRC operated over closed swing. This interpretation, uh, we apply this interpretation is a closed string states in the open SFT. I mean, uh, for example, uh, uh, the cross string uh, is given by, uh, uh, is represented by this state uh, in the open SFT. Here, V is a matter vertex operator for on shell cross string states, and I is a uh, ket representation of the identity, identity strings field. So, uh, it, is, it is easy to find that uh, the state is invariant separately for Q plus prime and Q minus prime. I mean, a Q plus prime times uh, acting on uh, V equals zero, uh, Q, uh, Q prime minus uh, acting on V equals zero. Similarly, in closed string theory, uh, an on shell closed string state is given by uh, V equals CC tilde, but this vertex operator inserted at uh, uh, in the origin at uh, unit disk on the unit disk. Since, since V is a one one primary operator, this state ket V is also invariant under the under the action of Q V and Q B children separately. So uh, this this situation these situations are very similar to each other. Uh, in in closed string field theories Gauge transformation for cross string field phi is given by uh, the phi equal Q B plus Q B to the lambda times lambda. If it uh, in this gauge transformation, Q B plus Q B to the is in, the form of, uh, of this form is included. Also, on shell state is invariant separately. The uh, quadratic term of the action for closed string field theory is not invariant under the transformation uh, Q, uh, delta phi equal QB lambda plus QB tilde lambda. Similarly, uh, the open string field theory action at the tachyon vacuum is invariant under the G, under this gauge transformation. Here, the, uh, in this gauge transformation, we find uh, uh, Q plus prime plus uh, Q minus prime. <clears throat> but the quadratic term is not invariant for separately. Thus, uh, <coughs> here, uh, uh, the open string field theory as a tachyon vacuum has an analogous structure to closed string field theory and the, the correspondence of the BRC operated. So, how much time? <laughs> 50, 50. Uh, okay, uh, next uh, we, uh, we discussed uh, some, uh, some operators on the tachyon vacuum. Uh, we define an uh, operator of the, on the tachyon, at the tachyon vacuum, uh, Q, 
this is given by uh, that curly TZ. TZ is defined by anti commutation relations, anti ghost, and uh, Q prime. And uh, uh, and multiplying some exponential, uh, the function the exponential minus hg. So explicitly we can calculate the, uh, like this form. <clears throat> we find that, that this curly tz satisfies the same op as tz with zero central charge. I mean, uh, uh, here uh, uh, it is noted that t this curly tz include not only operators, uh, but also functions uh, h, hz, delta h, uh, and so on in, in, this, in its form. Since hz is a coordinate frame of world seat, some world seat, this curly tz has an explicit dependence on the frame. But we find that uh, this, uh, uh, this tz uh, satisfy the same OP as TZ. It is remarkable feature as a talking vacuum. By using curly TZ, we can define the continuous BS operator as a talking vacuum. Where the weighting function is related to HZ as uh, GZ equals Z exponential HZ. For the talking vacuum, exponential HZ has second order zero at Z equal plus minus one. GZ has second order zeros at Z equal plus minus one. So, uh, we, uh, we have already uh, sh shown that the uh, general structure of SSLD mechanism, this operator satisfies holomorphic as, and anti-holomorphic continuous virtual algebra for C equals zero. And L zero equals H plus and L tilde equals H minus. By definition of TZ, curly TZ, this operator commutes with Q plus minus, uh, Q prime plus minus. So, uh, we conclude that we found the continuous Virasoro algebra as tachyon vacuum, holomorphic and anti-holomorphic counterpart. For the ghost numbers, uh, it is better to define a ghost and uh, anti-ghost field at the tachyon vacuum as follows. Uh, this, are, uh, these are also frame-dependent operators. Uh, it means uh, it, it includes the function hz as tz, but they clearly satisfy uh, the same op, uh, you, uh, conventional uh, go, uh, uh, the same as the com uh, conventional ghost. Uh, moreover, it can be easily checked by the OP of TZ and uh, C prime and uh, B prime, a primary operator with a conformal weight minus one and two, respectively. And moreover, we find that the uh, curly TZ is given by anti commutation ratio Q prime and B prime. We uh, further uh, we find uh, we give a uh, ghost number current at the tachyon vacuum by using this this C prime and uh, B prime uh, as uh, as conventional ghost number. Uh, since it should be it should be defined by normal ordering usual uh, normal ordering description, the current uh, the curly J ghost E is related to the conventional ghost number current as follows. This is also a frame dependent operator due to HZ. And there, uh, we can easily find that it satisfies the same OP as those of a part of the vacuum, uh, like, this, like this OP. We can define uh, operator counting the ghost number. Uh, this satisf uh, we can easily check that uh, uh, the following commutation relation with the modified BRT operators. This, okay, sorry. this implies that the QC, uh, QC prime plus, QC minus plus counts the, form, counts the holomorphic and anti-holomorphic ghost number respectively. 
here, uh, but uh, uh, it is interesting to consider the relation of QC prime plus minus to the conventional Gauss number QC. Here, by using this relation, uh, integrate, by integrating uh, on both sides, no. uh, they are related by this relation. So, QC, uh, uh, Gauss, number, uh, uh, Gauss number for the holomorphic part and the Gauss number uh, anti holomorphic part, uh, they added by uh, usual Gauss number plus some functions, uh, some integration of some functions. So, however, the integration on the, on the right hand side is, is ill-defined because uh, uh, exponential hz uh, has second order zeros on the boundaries, and so del, del h uh, is diverged at, uh, at, at, at such zeros. So uh, this result reflects the fact that the ghost number for open strings is not defined on the tachyon vacuum since we we have no open strings at the tachyon vacuum. It is a reasonable result. Also, uh, similarly, we can uh, define the VRC current on the tachyon vacuum. As well as other operators, Kali JB satisfy the same OP as the conventional ones. In addition, the modified VRC operator Q prime can be rewritten by using this Kali JB. Uh, by usual relations. I will give concluding remarks. <clears throat> uh, we he <coughs> now uh, <coughs> we we have discussed uh, SSLD uh, in open string system, and uh, uh, we have shown that as a result of the decoupling of left and right moving mode, the SSLD system is equivalent to a closed string system in the sense that we find uh, holomorphic anti holomorphic continuous Virasol algebra. Secondly, well, we have considered open SF SFT expanded around the identity based tachyon vacuum solutions. We have found that the modified VRC, VRC operator is decomposed to a holomorphic and anti holomorphic parts which are anti-commutative and nilpotent. Uh, this operator is uh, uh, analogous to closed-string BRC operators, and so uh, gauge symmetry of open, SF open SFT at the tachyon vacuum is regarded as that of closed-string field theory. And uh, uh, as, uh, as, a, as a point, uh, we have constructed uh, various local operators at the tachyon vacuum, in energy momentum tensor, ghost anti ghost field, and the ghost number current, and BRC current. Uh, it is a remarkable feature that these operators, depending on the frame, of, uh, I mean, uh, weighting function GZ, uh, which is uh, chosen by identity based tachyon vacuum solutions. Uh, from these operators, we have found that continuous virus algebra at those number of operators. The point is that we have holomorphic and the holomorphic parts which are realized by SSD mechanism. The theory at the identity based tachyon vacuum solution uh, possesses a gauge symmetry generated by holomorphic and the holomorphic BRC operator which is identified with the gauge symmetry of closed string field theory. So, uh, if we consider gauge symmetry is an essential ingredient in SFT, we conjecture that the theory at the identity-based tachyon vacuum provides a, a kind of closed string field theory. So, uh, this is the string picture before and after this is LD. Uh, the solid line uh, corresponds to the polymorphic dashed line, uh, corresponds to the anti part of the string. 
so as a result of SS3D mechanism, open string boundaries become joined and the open string divided to uh, anti-homorphic strings. So uh, uh, SSLD mechanism is uh, essentially the same as a naive, naive order intuition. So, oh, that's all. Thank you. Unique. Yeah. What do you there mean? Unique? Other, other way. Uh, we have a freedom to choosing a function of G Z. So we have uh, another possibility of splitting of anti homorphic anti homorphic parts. I mean. Uh, but I think, uh, I believe that uh, uh, in the context of string field theory, th these differences are connect connected by gauge transformation of string field theory. So, so in the sense of SFT, it, it is unique, I think. Uh, one idea is uh, when I when I proved uh, when I calculated the vacuum energy of the identity-based solutions, we use the equi uh, gauge equivalence of uh, tachyon solution and uh, the solution generated by KBC algebra, right? and so. I think uh, the key, the key idea is uh, gauge transformation of SFT. But, but explicitly, I, I, I can't realize such a decoupling for other solutions. I have, I have any ideas to realize such a decoupling. Discrete. <laughs> no, uh, I don't. I have not yet understand the uh, relation to the continuous virtual algebra to and uh, discrete discrete virtual usual virtual algebra. It. Uh, Uh -huh, uh -huh. That, uh, yeah, you are, you are, <laughs> your question is uh, is important uh, to study the continuous virtual algebra of this system. Uh, it is an interesting but difficult problem now at present. I, we have... Uh, 
Mm. Sorry, at present we, we can't. Ex uh, we can give you. Uh, in, uh, we can't. We can't explain this this, this problem. Sorry. Uh, Uh, anyway, uh, the, this relation of continuous uh, the, this, uh, discrete, discrete uh, virtual algebra uh, should be should be should be clarified, I think. But uh, but I can't I can't uh, say more about that.